A pair of jeans that regularly costs $40 is on sale for 30% off. As part of a promotion, each customer will also receive an additional discount on the marked sale price at the cash register. If the final price of the jeans was $22.40, what additional discount was applied to the marked sale price? All right, this is interesting and useful because we need to know what we're going to pay for our jeans. All right, so the regular price is $40. We're going to assume everything is in dollars. It's on sale for 30% off. Well, if you're 30% off, that means it's going to be it's going to cost 70% of the regular price. So, let's put 70% of 40. So, let's multiply that times 0 0.7, which is the same thing as 70%. 0 40 times 0 0.7, that's going to be equal to 28 28 dollars, right? Yeah, seven times four is 28. Point seven times 40 is also going to be 28. All right, so it's going to be 28 dollars would just be the 30 percent off. But the final price of the jeans was 2240. What additional discount was applied to the marked sale price? Well, to figure that out, we can just divide. We can say, well, what fraction of 28 is 2240? 2240 divided by divided by 28. Well, this is going to be equal to, let's see, 28. And actually, you could even, you could even rule out, well, I'll, I'll do the arithmetic right over here. So 28 goes into 22, 2240. So get the decimal right over here. 28 doesn't go into 22, but it does go into 224. Let's think about it. How many times does 28 go into 224? I don't know, maybe. Maybe seven times. Let's see if this works. So it goes seven times. Seven times eight is 56. Seven times two is 14 plus five is 19. And then if we were to subtract, let's see, we could make this a 14, regroup from here. This would be a one. But then we regroup from here. This would be an 11. 14 minus six is, 14 minus six is eight. 11. Minus nine is two. Okay, so we actually could have gotten one more in there. So let's see. This is going to go. Twenty-eight goes into goes into two twenty-four exactly eight times. Eight times. Eight times eight is sixty-four. Sixty-four. Eight times two is sixteen. Plus six is twenty-two. No remainder. So this is this is eighty percent of the marked down price. So if it, if this is 80%, if this is 80% of this, then the then the additional discount that was taken is going to be 20% because you take once you take 30% off, you would expect to pay $28, but you only paid 80% of that. So they took off another 20%. They took off another 20%. If you take off 20%, then you're going to pay 80% of the price.